So I heard you guys also had jets during the war, but I never met any of them. Well, the truth is that they were held back for the most part because they just weren't needed. Exactly. Spitty and I were enough to end things. The jets were very expensive, and it was feared if they were shot down that they'd be captured by Germany or even the Soviets. That makes sense. 262 was too late to help us significantly. Had she been out sooner, I'm sure our jets would have met her. Could we meet them now? I'd love to make new friends. Oh, well, that's probably not a good idea. Yeah, I would rather not bring them into this right now. Oh, why not? Did I do something wrong? Goodness, no, not at all. You're perfect just the way you are. Our jet cousins are just a bit... Insufferable? Well... Pompous? Sort of... A blight upon basic social interactions. Pretty much all of that. They can't be worse than Kika. You mean 262's half-sister? Yes, her. She's just like her German sibling. I mean, I'd almost take a constant state of fury over blatant disrespect. Disrespect? What is up, losers? You know it ain't a party until we show up. Let the pain commence. Stay strong, friend. Oh, hello. You must be America's and Britain's jets. Uh, duh. And who are you? That prop with those wings? Lame outfit. Oh, I, I picked them out myself. Okay, no. You can be as rude as you want to me or Mustang, but don't you dare shame 190. Or oh, coming to her defense, Slowpoke. Didn't know you were likable enough to make friends. Okay, I see exactly what you guys were talking about now. They have their good side, but... No, they're just the worst. Don't be afraid to say it. God, this place reeks of old. Who are you calling old? You lot, duh. You two didn't even do anything during the war. Sure we did. I flew recon in Italy. And I shot up some enemy planes on the ground. And while you were doing that, Mussy and I were mixing it with 109 and 190 over bloody Berlin. Uh, hello. We're too important for that dirty work. Yeah, that stuff is for the help. Mussy, I refuse to believe these two have a good side. They, they do. They fought bravely in Korea and Shooting Star's daughter was one of the best trainers our military ever had. So proud of her. I admit you all did a fine job holding the line, but let's be fair, had we been out there, the war would have been over in a week. Now that's just absurd. What? You think your little Axis friends would stop us? I'm about to try. Same. You two are poopy heads. Ha, huh, you could never best us. No, perhaps you'd like to face 262 then. She's been eager for some vengeance. Thanks, I'll pass. Coward. I'd rather not sully my hands on that creature. She's almost as ugly as Eric Comet. Ah, oh, come on guys. You're always picking on me. Because you might as well be a dirty prop. I tried so hard. Uh okay, enough. You two seriously need to knock it off. You're no better than us. You were outclassed by future jets just as quickly and contributed next to nothing to our fight. Is that right? What are you going to do about it? What is all this commotion? Bubba, Blackbird, we were just... Just hanging out. Chilling. Vibing. Is that right? Mustang, can you confirm? They were bullying us and made Eric Comet cry. That's a lie. No, that's exactly what happened. Spot on. Precisely. Poopy heads. I just want to be loved. Hush now, little Comet. I'm sure your prop cousins would love to spend time with you. Ooh, I will. I'll be your friend. Really? Absolutely. Thank you, 190. So proud of you, cousin. As for you two. Eep! Uh-oh. I think you both need to spend some time with Phantom, too. No! But she's so... Professional and polite to her elder cousins. You can come back and apologize once you've learned something. I don't want to. Alternatively, I would gladly hurl you both into the stratosphere and leave you there until you figure out how to get back down. I'll take F4. Fine. You weren't kidding about those two. I'm so sorry. Are you okay, Era Comet? Yes, thank you. Should have let Kika and 262 out of their shackles to deal with them. As funny as that would be, I'm not sure they'd be restrained a second time. True enough. 